One of the most underrated parts of Korean cuisine is its pastry. Everyone younger than the age of 50 essentially grew up with a fusion of European and Japanese style baked goods. What I love about Korean pastry is that it relies on this pillowy dough that's not too sweet, making it the perfect vehicle for fillings like whipped butter, chestnuts, red beans, and sometimes even some bizarre creations like hot dogs and pizza. One of the hallmarks of a Korean community is always going to be a bakery because Koreans love baked goods. If you go to Korea, there's, there's a bakery on pretty much every corner and maybe two, like they're all on top of each other. Here in Atlanta, of course, they're going to have their own bakery scene. There's a place, this place, White Windmill, is um, it's a local chain. You know, they have a couple of places and they make everything in house. You can tell that it's really thoughtful, it's really well done. Um, and it is just, you know, it's pitch perfect. It's a great place to hang out and drink some house roasted coffee. Look at this thing. I mean, it's beautiful. It's hazelnut latte. Koreans love hazelnut with their coffee. I don't know why. Actually, I do know why. It's delicious. It's really, really good. I'm here with Andrew. He's one of the bakers here at White Windmill. And uh, he just finished up a batch of croissants. And he's going to go up with me. We're going to try a bunch of pastries. And he's going to tell me how they get made. Tell me about the sausage bread. This thing looks like a pretty amazing breakfast. Sausage in the middle, and then we wrap bread around it. Ooh. Just dump vegetables and cheese on the top. But we put mayo, ketchup, a lot of things. <laughs> I don't even know how to eat the, this. The sausage is resisting. <laughs> mm. There you go. That just makes me happy. I love that, because that sausage is just like a surprise. And you have yeah. you know, cheese and corn and, and tomato sauce and just everything yeah. in there. This tomato sauce gives it a little kick. Oh man, yeah. it, is, uh, it is a complete bite. Growing up, it was like these things were the things that my mom would always bring home. Let's try this manju. This is the chestnut one. Yeah, so the skin's made up of uh, egg yolk, condensed milk, flour, a little bit of that, and then um, we kind of get into a doughy, like almost like a gooey texture, mm -hmm. and then fill it in with uh, the red bean or white bean or whatever the manju is. And when it comes to traditional Korean baking, this is one of the original items. Mm. It just it just seems very hearty, so it'll yeah. last a while. Like it's just a usable snack. For me, I remember growing up eating these kind of things, you mm -hmm. know, anything like red bean bread and then manju. Those are the classic. Yeah, because they're just like you, you know, your mom just leaves them out on the table. Yeah, you just grab one whenever you just need a little quick snack. It doesn't have really the plushness of the other dough, but um, it's very comforting and it's not super sweet. No, this is straight up Korea right here. <laughs> oh man. Okay, this is the soboro. Oh yeah. Ooh, you got a little bit of cream in there too. Oh. Nice and moist, super soft. As you eat it, the peanutty like crust, it's almost like a peanut butter cookie. Yeah. That's basically what it is. It's a peanut butter cookie that's laid atop a piece of sweet, sweet bread. Um, and you get that slight edge of saltiness, nuttiness, yeah. to contrast the sweetness. It's, it's really, a, these, all these pastries are just addictive. You want to keep eating them. So this is the um, patbang. Papang. Papang. Yeah, so this is yeah red bean with that kind of that sweet pillowy dough. Yeah. See it all there. And the classic taste. <laughs> you probably eat this stuff all day, right? Yes. A bun goes missing all the time. And like, where'd that one go? <laughs> Andrew got it. <laughs> this for me right here is waking up Saturday morning, right? You know, after school, going down the stairs, sticking this in the microwave a little bit, right? Oh, and then... you're totally right. Honestly, like just top tier, like it's just as good as you can expect Korean pastries to be. You guys are killing it. Cool. This is yeah. awesome. Thank you so much. Uh, you're gonna pay for this, right? Oh no, yeah, yeah. we're gonna pay. Oh yeah, yeah, of course, yeah, yeah. That's why we have all this. Okay. okay. All right. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, no problem. <laughs>